You have probably wondered more than once how to implement clear messages for users in your React Native application. My name is Dominik Danilewicz and in this video we will compare three libraries that will help you achieve this goal. Let's start! First library is called Burnt. It's a very simple and lightweight library for displaying notifications in React Native app. It doesn't have many features, uh, but it's doing what it's supposed to do. At its core, Burnt offer both toast and alert methods. This allows developers to show UI notifications, brief messages or prompts to the user without interrupting their main activity. Integrating Burn is very straightforward. This simple code allows you to dispatch a toast notifications to the user informing them that a burnt was installed. Burnt provides support across Android, iOS and even the web. This means uh, that regardless of where your React Native application is deployed, Burnt is designed to seamlessly integrate and function. When it comes to customization, it offers only basic options, such as changing the icon, uh, its size and color. Burnt doesn't have extensive documentation but the examples on the library website allow for a smooth implementation. Among the key functions, I must mention native component utilization. Burnt uses native components. This guarantees performance and a genuine look and feel. The next feature is iOS like alerts. If you ever noticed the alerts on the Apple App Store, Burnt can replicate those, providing a familiar user experience. In terms of modal overlays, uh, historically showing notifications over modals has been a challenge in React Native. Burnt resolves this, ensuring that even if a modal is open, notifications are visible and uh, don't disrupt the UX. The next library we will look into is React Native Toast Message. It's even lighter than previous one, with a size of only around 40 kilobytes, which of course ensures minimal impact on the overall bundle size of the application. Its main aim is to provide developers with a seamless way to notify users of events, successes, errors or additional information. Integrating React Native Toast message into your project is simple. Depending on your package manager, either use Yarn or NPM for installation, Basic usage is also effortless, just import the library, render the toast component within your main app file and then invoke toast messages using methods from anywhere in the app. This library has prepared documentation where most of the functionality is described along with uh, examples. Uh, this makes it easier for us to use it. One of the library's strengths is its flexibility in customization. Developers can create uh, completely new Toast layouts or adjust existing ones, uh, using the config prop giving you the ability to create unique uh, Toast designs. One of the important features I want to mention is Keyboard Aware. The Toast messages are designed to detect and adapt to keyboard presence, uh, ensuring that they don't get hidden behind an active keyboard. Another noteworthy functionality is Easy Notification Management. React Native Toast Message allows specific configurations so developers have granular control over how and when the Toast displays. Also, I would like to highlight that it has integration with React Navigation. Our next focus will be on React Native Notificated. At first, I must point out the very good documentation. It practically guides you from the very beginning, uh, from installation through individual uh, functionalities uh, with code snippets and uh, explanations. It's very easy to start using it. You just need to install it, create notifications, wrap your app with a notification provider and that's it. You are ready to emit uh, the notifications. There are four predefined types of notifications, success, error, warning and info. Uh, someone might think that it's not enough. Uh, that's why the authors made it fully customizable. You can change styling globally and that will affect all the notifications. Another option is to style only one type, for example a success one. It's also possible to modify just a single instance of the notification in your app, 
to look different. What is more, you can create your custom variants for more specific notification. If you want to dismiss your notification, you can swipe. Of course, it is possible to change the direction settings to your preferable. This is not the end of the customization options. You can choose your preferred animation for appearing and disappearing notifications from a preset or prepare your own animation. Also worth noting is that it's fully typed, so you have better protection from unexpected errors. Moreover, notifications are queued, so you will only see one notification at a time. It also supports a dark mode. Now it's time for a short summary. As you can see, I rated each library on a several aspects on a scale of 1 to 3. The higher the node, the better. In the aspect of possibilities, you can definitely achieve more with React Native Notificated. Push notifications, error handling, notification in models, uh, personalization level in overall, and more. It's all making its very powerful library. In React Native Toast Message, you have less options, and Burnt rounds out the list. Regarding customization, again the highest note goes to React Native Notificated. I might risk saying that the quantity of tailoring options make it the most customizable notification library for React Native. React Native Toast Message allows for a more restrictive range of personalization. Meanwhile, Burns offer modifications only at the very basic level. When we look at the size, React Native Toast Message takes the lead. Right behind it we have Burned and on the last place there is a React Native Notificated. If you examine the documentation, you will notice that React Native Notificated has it very well prepared. React Native Toast Message has also quite a good guide, but it's not that detailed. In my opinion, Burnt has a very sparse documentation. When it comes to platform support, only Burnt supports Android, iOS and the web. Other libraries on our list are compatible with both Android and iOS. So, if you need flexibility and you want to adapt the notifications to your design, you definitely should try React Native Notificated. In other situations where you simply want to show slightly styled information to users, I would go with React Native Toast Message or Burnt. Okay, so that's it for today. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing for more content like this. Don't forget to click the notification bell so you never miss the update. Until next time, take care and see you soon.